Good evening guys, Donatron here. This is going to be my first official video. Alright, and in the spirit of Halloween, we're going to be playing some horror games. Alright, and to start us off with, we're going to be playing Greetings. Let's start. I'm sorry I might not be talking too much, but it's okay. I will try and speak up as much as I possibly can though because I've been told that I speak too softly. Even though I've got a deep voice. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> okay then <laughs> I have never played such a short game before <laughs> thank you Charlie Behan <laughs> and Sierra and Mooney this is actually a pretty funny game alrighty so that was greetings let's move on to the next one Mm, let's see here. Can't play that one. Let's go. guys on to the next game known as lucid dream okay I didn't really do any of my research on the games but I thought they were gonna be fun I fell asleep in bed like always but I had a weird dream that day the story is about the dream. Okay, it's mine. This is still a dream. I can't wake up. Hospital on fire. In 1987, fire broke out at the hospital. There were no survivors because the explosion was all of a sudden. It took 12 hours to extinguish the fire. The police investigated the cause of the fire but could not find it. 12 medical staffs and many patients died. A memorial was held at a nearby park to pay respect to the victims of the accident. The answer is in the dark. Page of book. It looks like there's room for a book. How do I use? Okay, give me one second.
What the? How to play. Okay, I should have started with this. This is a point and click game. Play the game only with your mouse click. You can access the menu by pressing escape, but the game is not paused. This game does not provide saving. If you end the game or go back to the main menu, you'll lose your progress. Interactive objects are highlighted when the mouse cursor is placed on them. Non-interactive objects do not make any difference by playing them by placing the mouse cursor on them. Items in the inventory only interact with certain objects. Okay, the flashlight provides visibility in dark conditions. Apparently not, because I have clicked on it multiple times and it doesn't work. Oh my gosh. Alrighty, so let's do this one. <laughs> now I can close it. Uh, Go down this hall one more time. Door, door lock, hidden key. Oh, I can't go down there this time. Okay. Oh, wait. Thought I saw something. No, just the curtain. Door's not locked this time. Medical records, 1985-0814. Test has been started. Subject info, 171, 171 centimeters, 63 kilograms, male. Substance A, 10 milliliter and administered to subject. Subject feels weak, dizzy, and nauseated. 1985-0817. Substance A, 15 milliliter administered to subject. Vomiting and seizure symptoms. 1985-0818. Removed. 1985 August 19th, test subject died. Okay. Now we know who's walking around. How do I leave? Leave. Leave. Got it. Back to the north. Oh. Don't have the code. She died. Died. If I out. Uh, she reported the truth of this facility. Oh God, please punish them. Tomorrow will be a big day. Rest in peace, Ava. She spoiled her. Killed her.
And that was it. Now how do I leave? I need to find a code. For. Oh, it's locked, huh? Just upstairs. That kind of does suck to where you have to continuously click on the flashlight every time you enter a new room. Okay. So did I make a mistake in the opening to the issue? Was that you know like the dark? I don't know the code. Oh. I don't even know where I can go now. Who's that? Oh, I got it now. 712. Gotcha, gotcha. That's smart. Did I go down the wrong hall? Yes, I did. this Recently I received an anonymous call from a facility asking for help. Please check it out and let me know what happened. I hope everything is okay. Have a nice day. Hmm? 
What am I supposed to do? I need a tool. I don't have the right tool. Alright, let's see if I can put that page. This option was taken away. in the toilet and apparently I need a cup there's nothing in here just give up on this, but I don't know what else to do. I wish I knew. There's a handle, but I need a tool to take it. There's no other tool, because the only tool I saw was a screwdriver, and that's already been used to take out the fusee. Go try and figure out what the mirror is for. Nothing here. <clears throat> oh, that's cool. No, 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 no. <clears throat> Sunlight mirror growth. Okay. Now I understand the mirror. 
<laughs> this threw me for a loop. I think they have a plan. They must be trying to escape. Be ready for that. Okay. They'll be ready for me. Don't have a key. To the director of the institute. Recently, one of the researchers leaked confidential information about the facility. I'm very disappointed about this. I believe you can handle this without any problem. There is no second chance. I warn you once again, don't let the subject escape. Kill anyone who could be a threat to our project. No information should be leaked out. Anonymous. Looks like somebody wasn't happy. Not sleepy now. Stab a picture with a knife. Okay. Why would I want to do that? First is finger, now it's iris. Do the bathroom. I don't even know what this door handle is for. Oh, I know what it's for. Sound came from the other side of the wall. One place opposite. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, that got me. Ah, I can't believe that got me. What did I need over here? Absolutely nothing. It says stab a picture with a knife, so let's go back. Run, 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 run. How do I run? No, 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 no. Oh, I got chills down my spine. I didn't expect this to actually be that creepy. They're gonna kill me. Please tell the truth to the outside world. If I can get out, I will. Back to the reverse world. The mirror. This one was fingerprint recognition. Oh, that's right. Oh, wait a minute. And no. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Oh, I got a key. What did I need a key for? All right. creepy at all. And tape. Okay, cool. So... <sighs> Two things on the other side. Oh, 
I got it. Okay, cool. Now I think I know where I'm getting the cup. Actually, a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. They're gonna kill me. Please tell the truth to the outside world. And I'm in the wrong portion. <laughs> I need to go to the mirror world. It's actually a lot of fun. Cup, cup, cup. Mother of all heaven on earth. Stabbing bird in the picture. I'm confused. A picture in here. Two out of three. Can I now? Can I really? No, I'm trapped in the mirror world. Well, let's go to bed. So I fell asleep again in my dream. And another space appeared in front of me in that dream. coming. She's coming. I can hear it. Oh. 
Alrighty, well, that was Lucid Dream. Let's get out of this. No, 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 no. Yes, okay. So, that was Lucid Dream, and... Mm, where is it? Sorry, it got a little dark, my other screen. Alright, guys, welcome to Black Rose. Again, <laughs> did not do any research on any of these games, so it's just as much mystery to me as it is to you. Let's go story. Spooky scary. Oh, guess I don't get to well, let's run. I guess they were pretty serious about keeping this door shut. I wonder if the keys are around here somewhere. Someone else here? This door was war is warped pretty badly. I don't think I'd be able to get it open. Boss is not to go near Myrtle's coffin. Why won't the grave digger bury it anyway? It's not like what Boss says is true. I mean, the dead can't really talk, can they? It's jammed, but I might be able to force it open. I would need to ram it a couple times. There's a baby monitor here. Strange. Who is that? I don't want to go downstairs, if that is an option. I mean, I'll go to the front door and leave. 
ですかね。Restricted area, authorized personnel only. Okay. It's locked. Okay. Well, I did say go downstairs and I tried. Claustrophobic. Uh, definitely where you get killed. Her eyes do not look her in the eyes. I promise I won't. The other baby monitor is down here. This is weird. I'm not sure I want to be here anymore. Something feels wrong. Yep, let's get out. Out, out, out. Don't go. I want to go. Stay here with me. I don't want to stay here with you. Oh, no, it's closed. What's going on? Run! No, run! Uh -oh. oh my god! <laughs> oh, okay, that one got me. Ooh. Yeah. Well. Okay, that was Black Rose. Let's move on to a different game, okay? Oh yeah, that that was that was something else, everybody. Wow, that was a head rush. Mm. Uh no. Okay, let's get out of that one. Alright, let's try this one. Horror Veil. All right. Record. No, I don't want... No. Okay, fine. Oh, that's right. No mouse is required in this game. Greetings. Sorry. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, and everything else to the Carnival of Lost Souls. I am your ringmaster, Poe. Today we have a tale to tell. A most frightening tale, the likes of which has never been told before. Wow, this is so loud. A tale about a young girl named Alice, her dog, and an adventure beyond your wildest imagination. It is said as part of my cultures and beliefs that there lies a place deep below the Earth's crust. We'll call it the Underworld. The Underworld is a scary place where the most fiendish and ghoulish of monsters and hooligans live and run free, freely. Ah. However, when this spooky realm lies a small valley and town simply known as Horror Vale, it is here where Menaguri of <laughs> ghastly creatures have found a place to call home. As previously mentioned, our story follows a young girl. Her name is Alice. Alice is a student enrolled at Horrorville High, where she practices witchery. Alice is about to embark, embark on an adventure beyond her wildest imagination. Soon, everything she's ever known shall be turned upside down. 
What will happen? Quite frankly, I'm just as ex <laughs> quite frankly, I'm just as excited as you are to find out. Let's begin, shall we? Act zero. Okay. <laughs> it's Mr. Fuzzles. <laughs> this house might be dangerous today. If I can't remember how to battle, I think there's a game manual on the bookshelf. Let's go take a look. Death points when they run out. Your body falls apart. Game over. Fear points. These let you use abilities. Make sure you can serve them well. Welcome to the world of Horror Vale and Horror Vale. You may, uh, in Horror Vale, you may find yourself in a situation where you'll need to fight. In that event, there's a few things you may need to know. Let's quickly go through them. Let's quickly go through it. Not like you care. Who reads manuals anymore? I see that tab with a walkthrough pulled up. You disgust me. <laughs> okay. It's locked. No, there isn't a key or a secret switch somewhere to open this. I'm serious. This is your dad's room. No way of opening it. What's his room? How's he gonna open it? <laughs> <laughs> a chair emerged. <laughs> Two pieces of candy. Listen, sir. <laughs> Listen, see. You've got a good outfit here, see. <laughs> We're gonna keep haunting this place, see. Anyways, here's the month's rent, Alice. Got 40 pieces of candy. Ooh, okay. Oh, Some ghosts look like bed sheets, while others look normal. What's up with that? Where does the distinction lie? At what point after death does death decide who gets the bed sheets and who gets legs? What about a bed sheet ghost with legs? That would just be ridiculous, right? Okay. So I've been trying to get the boss to quit smoking. Doesn't he know it can kill you? <laughs> right. Off to school, Alice? Your father left already. I saw him running around through various rooms before he left. I think he locked you in again. That guy really loves puzzles, huh? Ooh. I'm saying 20 candy. Why is this in the bathroom? Now a book. Awesome. <laughs> I have new ability. Heal. There's something hitting in these chests, but I just can't figure out how to open all of them. A certain order? Or is that too easy? Oh, let's find it. That was easy. You got one of the house keys. Fancy. Oh, candy. No. Ring of magic. No. Thank you. 
Doggo! Undog. Okay. It's your undog, Scruffy. You need to be careful when you leave. He always tries to bolt out the door. Huh? Scruffy has something he wants to give you. You got the flu. <laughs> that looks like he wants to go with you. Yay, a new friend. Okay, let's see which. I'm a pot that refuses to sit on a table. Since my only purpose to exist is for decoration, at least this way I can be unique. I'm a table with nothing on it. I tried to get the pot over there to sit on me, but he's adamant and not sitting on anything. I admire his resolve, but what am I supposed to do if my only purpose is to hold objects on top of me? Okay. I've been trying to get into the boom closet, but this dumb ghost won't let me by. Not only that, none of my attacks do anything to him. I've heard that enemies with red names during battle can't be defeated by normal means. In which case, you should either run or try something else. I wish I could do. I wish I could find a special item or something I could use against him. got me. Uh, Scruffy took him out. Okay. Charm of defense. Let's go ahead and equip that. Shower ghost, huh? Oh, that was easy. When you're dead, you don't need to eat. But we still do it anyway because it's fun. Really though, I don't get it. Isn't the no hungry thing one of the perks? <laughs> Pure thing, so. Oh. Um, I'm not moving from the spot, so if you want to get by, too bad. Stubborn ghost emerged. Well, looks like that's the item either. Got another house key. Thank you. 
Nothing. A big old comfy couch. Or is it a sofa? What's the difference? I honestly don't know. This here is a regular everyday lamp. Nothing's freaky about it. It's all right. Oh, okay. I thought I saw your dad hide something in here. Maybe if you examine stuff, you can find whatever it was. Well, I wonder where it could be. Definitely not this blinking light. You got one of the house keys. That Netherland just stole the car keys. I need to the car. No. Aha! Two. And now I got the car key. I'm a pot who's. Oh, what does it matter? My existence is that of cooked clay. By the way, Alice, I thought I saw your dad put something in the back seat of the hearse. You unlock the car door and search the car. The house key. I should go save. Looks incredibly comfy. Would you like to save? Yes. In addition to my bed, I can save at any coffins I find along the way. Answer. Alright guys, it's almost time to start winding down, but I'm gonna step outside. Oh, now the lamp comes after me.
Okay. Steal. Oh! Look at that. The true winner here is calcium. I can feel power in my bones. Oh, I just leveled up. And new poison. Oof. Okay. Oh, yep. I got away. Great. Uh, I should find Scruffy before he gets himself into trouble again. Act 1. Horville. Skeleton Man. It said coffins, not graves. Okay. So, yep, it is time to... Okay, this game got interesting to me. No, no, no. Okay, I'll play this another time. And I'll start over where I was last. And I could do this as a playthrough. Because this is actually a lot of fun. I like this. Let's save. Okay, guys. Well, that is it for today. That'll be it for today. Um, now I hope you all are doing well during this whole COVID pandemic. Uh, stay safe, follow the rules, wear your mask when you're going out, going to the stores, restaurants, you know, just stay clean, okay? Also, I am going to leave links in the description for the games I have played so far, uh, if you do want to play them later on. Other than that, I hope you guys have a fantastic Halloween, even though it's not here yet. October has been great so far. I can't wait for the snow. But, alrighty guys. Enjoy. Have fun. And I will see you all later. Bye.